before diving into the details. It's always good to remember that rating Camry performance is a subjective matter. While Ximark certainly does a thorough job testing Camrys in all sorts of conditions, it is a human who scores each attribute, as opposed to an objective test like CPU benchmarking. So, how did the Galaxy Note 8 do? The device received an overall score of 94 points just like the iPhone 8 Plus. However, the Note 8 scored lower on the video portion coming in at 84 points, lining up with Kinect's recent review, with the photo subscore coming in at a record 100 points. Wild Zimark shares that there is a lot to love about this camera, it calls it the best smartphone for zoom. Here is a comparison of the Note 8 and iPhone 8 Plus at 8x zoom. Another aspect where Zimark feels the Note 8 camera shines is with bokeh effect, when it works. Zimark notes that, repeatability is also a bit hit and miss, and although the bokeh effect kicks in more often when shooting static subjects, we found the effect wasn't applied on around a third of our portrait shots. 